I, I was experiencing an echo, but like uh, the, the game on like the game one was way quicker. Oh yeah, I forgot you have a mountain gun. Okay, did, did you heal yourself? Yes. His name is. Uh, yeah, I'm using entry kits. Oh yeah, I forgot I have a, I have a skill points. <laughs> I'm honestly so tempted to either upgrade my hard ass, my first aid, or my brawling. But my, my brawling would cost a lot more, so I'm kind of holding off. Well, the way I think, well, the way I see it is, may as well just save up for it and get it knocked out of the way, because, uh, what's it called? I don't know how the level up system works for this game to the point where we might get less XP points to spend. Yeah, uh, that's. That's kind of what I'm thinking. That's also why I haven't finished upgrading Quan because I'm having him save up for either Kiss Ass or automatic weapons. All right. Well, I'd probably just put him towards uh, automatic weapons because uh, that way, if we find upgrades, we can just put him on there. But then again, the explosive crossbow is doing work for him. Yeah, that's why I haven't really been worried about it. All right, is there anything else around here that we should be concerned about? Uh, no. We actually explored everything. I mean, there's one place outside that I'm going to go check out, because it seems like I can go in there. Okay. Alright, alright. Oh. Hold on, oh, fuck. I hate, I hate that it doesn't automatically do the squad. Okay, there's like a broken down fence I can stand on top, but I can't go towards this shack. Come on, game. Alright, so we have to go back to... The monster mall to give the film reel. That's step one. Oh, okay. And then after that, we can go out towards the radiation areas finally, because we have radiation shielding one. Oh yeah, fuck! I forgot. Thank you for reminding me because I was actually really fucking pumped about it. Mhm. Mm this is why I keep everything in a memo. Mm -hmm. Well, that was also why I didn't really want to end this end the stream, but you had to go, and I was like, ah, because we just got radiation shielding. Yeah. I mean, like literally, like I'm not too worried about losing track because I literally have a sharpie next to me and like a few small sticky note index cards. I can just write memos of Wasteland Three. Mm -hmm. The only time I forgot to do so was because we were going off into midnight on the weekend. Oh yeah. I've been watching. All right. Uh, what I saw in your soul the first time what? our eyes met. You were with your squad, being heroes in Colorado Springs. I was? Well, you know where I was. And you can come see me any time. <gasps> that was too much radiation. Yep, yep. <sighs> okay, we're, we're prepared for level one, not level two. Can we access this camp over here? Oh wow, shit! You're, you guys, you guys are down. Fuck. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. The, the camp to our right here. Are we able to access this? Or? Abandoned building. Flimsy shed groans in the wind. Four walls and half a roof. Could be worse. Use the shelter to hide the codec and then make some repairs. Stay the night to recuperate. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, we can search the place. Oh. What a relief. Need some downtime. Uh. Uh, tend to your injury. Yeah, tend to your injuries. Everyone you patched up feels a little better. How's your characters feeling? Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, about half health. Uh, but Crash has the chills. Yeah. Which only affects... Yeah, uh, but Private Joya Bell also has some, uh, internal bleeding. Injury kit time. I think it just means that we can only spend a set amount of time in in the, uh, what is it, in the zone. So we'll have to be quick. Alright, uh, let's see. What was it that we had to... Alright. I'm trying to remember exactly, uh... Because there were many places that were radiated. Uh, Hold on, let's mission log, we get that. Uh, let's see. So. Uh, I ran something over, god damn it. Yeah, 
was probably a deer. Deer all the way out here. Eh, one of them weirder things. Alright. You never know. By the way, I also had the radio signal playing of like, do you believe in love at first sight? And I became severely awkward because the lady sounded psychotic. Well, yeah. Do we have to go back to the bazaar? Or? Yeah, we have to go to the bazaar, go into the mall, and then drop off the tape. Oh, okay, because we got unwelcome guests. Uh, services as an advisor. Uh, room. what's it called? Promise. There's the n unwelcome guests. We have to head to Colorado Springs for that. Oh, okay, because I thought we be did that already. Cinema Verte, uh, okay. I yeah, I know that one. Okay, um... Should we also do the Zealot? Because we gotta... Hold on. Oh no, well, I was gonna say, let's do Cinema Verte. And then we can go do Unwelcome Guests, because we have to go talk to Gideon. Oh, okay. At the 100 Families. Okay. And then we can do the Zealot. Okay, Bizarre Interior, Bizarre Exterior, Warranty Store. Interior. Yeah, I figured. I, I figured... Now, why would they be wanting a film festival on the exterior, Evan? I, and a I bit of cold. I, I don't know. I mean, maybe light some fires, get a concealed area going. You know, you can insulate it. You know. I don't know. Attract a band. Attract a band of raiders. Get raided. Yeah, but if you have enough defenses and other things, I mean, you know, like, that's great. It's work for us. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I always imagined us in the post-apocalypse just being like sheriffs, like Brian and Brian and Peter during like when they were in the south. <laughs> Like, us as rangers, but we just got like a, I've got a big thing of alcohol, and you got a big thing of wine, and I'm just like, man, it's so uh, quiet around here, Val. It, it, I, gun, I, gun, I know. Guns I the, 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 with the communicator has it rung all day. I, I, I know. <laughs> all right. Ah, our clown slaying knights in shining armor. You Is that the YMCA happening in the background? Oh, uh, yeah, I think so. Or Earth, Wind, and Fire, you choose. Well, I definitely don't remember. Hmm. Uh, let's see what we've got here. Damn, this looks pretty bad. And? Can, can, you, still use, can you still use them? Where there's a will, there's a way. Just stand over there and look cute while I check this out. Okay, part of me wants the creators to have had enough to buy the licensing to use YMCA at least once. Yeah, I wonder how much how much it is to use it. Okay, what's the verdict? What's the verdict? Hold on, please don't need us to find more. Any chance? Okay. Oh yeah, you own, yeah you own the conversation. Well, I won't lie. They aren't exactly what I was hoping for. But we can salvage this. It's a documentary in Colorado's so beaver population. <laughs> the film is falling apart, and I can't get a full show out of any of them. But I'm seeing bits and pieces that we could totally use with a bit of imagination. Considering there's a guy in the background looking to fondle another guy's ass, I'm pretty sure you have the imagination down. Let's examine yeah. the rails together, and we'll come up with a story worthy of chicks flicks. Here, look at these. Do you see a good main character? Oh God. <laughs> okay, let's take a, uh, okay. Let's take a gander here first. Who do you think it's going to be? Fake actors that sound like real actors, or real actors? I kind of want to go real actors on this one. I but like at the same time I don't think they have enough money for the licensing, so I'm going to go with fake actors pretending to be real actors. Like a fake movie film, like okay. a boot, like like a, like a terrible sci-fi movie. That's like Miracle Johnson. Yeah, like 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 that level. That's what I'm thinking. All right, we see a man running from a boulder. He has a hat and a whip. <laughs> da -na -na, na -na -na. <laughs> Uh, we see two cops, one older with a mustache, the other with a glorious mullet. Oh, God. The guy? I was thinking Starsky and Hutch or something. No. 
Yeah, that, there we go, Star Ski Edge. That's the only thing I can And then can we see a barefoot man in a tank top sneaking through an office building. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, especially since the, EP, the ERB came out with uh, John McClane versus John Rambo versus John Wick. <laughs> anyway. Well, that clearly escalated. Um... <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, yeah. It went from Indiana Jones to fucking was, Star Ski and Hutch. To uh, what is it? Uh, die Hard. What do, you, what do you want to perform, Val? Yeah. Oh God, uh, this is actually a little tricky. Um, because I mean, it's 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 in between the the middle one, the two cops, and Die Hard for me. I kind of want to go Starsky and Hutch. <laughs> Because it could be basically a parody of our, our adventures, if you will. Uh, yeah, who, who has the mullet. <laughs> oh, you know I'm all party in the back. <laughs> hey, hey, I'll let you decide. I mean, you own the conversation. I'll let you decide on this one. But then again, Die Hard, that's a... That's a classic. It's currently wintertime, Vince. That's a, that's a Christmas movie. Oh, hell yeah. But in Colorado, it's Christmas every day, so... <laughs> Where's the, where's the South Park option? <laughs> well, I mean, th these are movies. Four, four young kids go. arguing about arguing about nothing until one of them dies. Get shocked by lightning, tries to light a fart on fire. Hey, hey man, it's up to you, man. Okay, uh, you know what? Let's do the Star Skiing Hutch. Okay. Slowly their ardor takes over. Brilliant! So far apart in hairstyles, but so close in passions. A throbbing love story of two erstwhile partners. Okay, this is not where I was going. Okay. <laughs> nope. I'm starting to... I, no, this think... is not... I'm having regrets. <laughs> I was about to say, I think you're starting Wait, to... Evan, Evan, hold on. We forgot what kind of place this was. <laughs> yeah, this is like... Asking for a serious play. We became star Wait, hold on, no, no. Okay, so remember... This went from Starsky and Hutch to Brokeback Mountain pretty quickly. <laughs> well, no, no, no. I was going to say, like, you know American Dad when uh, Steve and his friends found the crashed plane that had the next Fast and Furious movie? Oh, yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> like, whoa, what the fuck? Oh, well, yeah, then Dom's bent over and, you know, he Tokyo drifts into... Okay. This is filled with some extremely graphic sexy. <laughs> That's a great setup, but we need to decide where it takes place. Here, look over these. Rooms. Come on, eighties disco parlor. <laughs> car racing down a road, like uh, a car, car racing. <laughs> <laughs> There's a wood ship, a pirate ship hidden in a cavern holding treasure. This looks like some kind of military oh, flight again. The, the Goonies. Yeah. Oh dear god, number one and three. Uh, this looks like some kind of military flight academy. Oh god, Top Gun. <laughs> you know what? I think we need to go into the danger zone, Evan. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm, I'm all for it. <laughs> oh, of course. The perfect place for simmering romances, long forlorn looks, hidden desires. A dashing rival pilot joins our romantic plot, and a triangle is formed. Great! Going on the highway. Now, for the pièce de résistance, my zone. lovelies. Some of these old reels still have semi-legible labels. Give it your best shot. Sex me up a title. All right. What <laughs> Pump friction. <laughs> romancing, the, <laughs> romancing the boat. Uh, fuck loose. <laughs> goat thrusters. <laughs> goat thrusters. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not nearly drunk enough for this. Uh, bit. Say, what is uh, something buying in a neighborhood? Who <laughs> <laughs> do you think that is? Goat Uh, yeah, it looks like someone's It's between two and three. Really? 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 I kind of like romancing the bone. It has that, like, you know, it's like... 
like that's like pride and penises, you know, like it's it's kind of it's kind of got that like subtle like you know like like Brokeback Mountain, like Brokeback Mountain's got like you can tell it's about. But yeah, but you gotta remember this is taking place. This is about two partners slash rivals in a flight academy. So at the very least, fuck loose might be the best one. Yeah, yeah. You know, hold on. I'll let you. I'll, I'll let you pick. I'll let you pick. I picked the last two. Uh, I kind of was heavily influenced. Yeah, you know, I gotta go. Uh, I, I, I kind of gotta go with your fuck loose thing because it kind of makes sense to be honest. Because I like romance in the boat. Don't right. get me wrong. I, I hope we don't have to watch oh, it. Oh yes, baby, that's perfect. <laughs> oh really? She did also say sex up. So yeah, sex oh, up. Yeah. Sex I sells. You have some beauties of your own with you. What do you think? Could one of your gorgeous friends star in our premiere? <laughs> Val, well, I long? swear to God. I promise. <laughs> How long? How long do you wait? Wait. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Alright, Quan. Go tell them. <laughs> oh my God. Well, I've been a fan of your work for many years, Adelon. It would be an honor. Oh my God. God. Oh, Marshal Kwan, it'll be our pleasure. Just don't go stealing the spotlight from any of my boys, okay? Ugh. A job well done, you. Okay, everyone, places our audience awaits. What's that? A script? <laughs> Darling, we don't need those. <laughs> Oh my god. Are we gonna watch the, oh my god, we're yeah. gonna watch this. Oh god, let's watch this train Evan passed me the whiskey. Yeah, that was <laughs> yeah, right here. A simple man. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Thank you. Ah, damn, I'm a little sad. Now don't you think your 80 would forget your dues? You've been such a big help, sugar pies. So here's your reward. 310 bucks for that, damn. Talk to no, them that's later to see how we got on, okay? Guitar ornament. Hey, we could put that on there. Make it look badass. All right. Uh, yeah. I think I've had enough. It did not go as I planned near the last half of Quan, but. In the fountain. Yeah. He's staring at us again. Don't make eye contact. Maybe hey, right. you leave Long John alone. All right, he's had a rough one. Sanctified with blood. Yeah. Blood sanctified by guns. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Before we. Guns. Oh, wait, guns. Can we, can we make sanctified ammo? with blood. Blood. Wait, make what now? Uh, make, make ammo. Cause crafting is one of those things that I keep forgetting. Yeah, we can make ammo. What, okay. what, do you, what, what ammo do you need? Uh... Okay. Crafting a frozen fair, by the way. Just yeah, I figured. I'm not, I'm not surprised. Uh, do we need 9 mil, or...? Um, oh crap, I honestly, I honestly forgot. The only reason why is because, uh... Oh, energy cells, that's what I was gonna make. Energy cells are... Uh, yeah. Uh, like, just remember, it's ten. It's it's ten per cell, though. Yeah, we really need to get more scrap. I'm really mad that we started selling scrap because at one point, because we were like, ah oh, man. Well, if you want, hon, if you want, we have a few extra items that we can sell off. Eh, nah, it's fine for now. I mean, we already got plenty of money. Well, so. no, I mean, because look, look, look at it. We have like we have a uh, seven plasma capsules for armor mods. Yeah, but uh, what is it? Uh, and all they do is like increase healing. Oh, well, Lucia can actually armor mod, so... She can do minor armor mod, if I remember correctly. How, how do we armor, then? Uh, what is it? I think she's just gonna use the ability. Oh, here we go. Modify armor. Yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> you'll see what you can modify your armor with, but uh, none of it's really being highlighted. Do you have anybody that... Uh... That, uh, oh, no, wait, because we need the modding skill. Okay, that would explain yeah. why. Does anybody, does anybody else have armor modding besides Lucia? Because Lucia only has one in it just because of the, uh, an item she has. Uh, let me see. Uh, no, Jody doesn't have it. Crash does not have it either. Oh, okay, then we might want to sell those when we get a chance. Either that or we could break them down for scrap. I'm good either way. You know what? Uh, man, let's just break them down for scrap. Alright, okay, come on. Let's get out of here. Alright. I figure, but, like, yeah, break the parts down for scrap, but we could also, uh, like, save weapons and armor to sell. Fair enough. 
because I feel like we'll get more bang for our buck if we just sell the actual like gear as opposed to actually no we may we may want to run a test of this like where we scrap both a component and an armor and see how much money they would be worth selling but also see how much scrap they produce by breaking down people who tell the mashers of the bazaar that it's actually spelled bizarre only ever do that once <laughs> uh, well. I wonder why well, yeah, I know, right? I mean, they, they seem so nice. But, uh, alright, that was ridiculously fun, just like everything in this game, but, uh, I'd say we get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I was kind of hoping for Quan to do the YMCA, but I guess hopes and dreams are broken. I yeah. he got to live his dream, at least. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's nice. I kind of wanted to see Lucia do it. I did not expect that commentary, though. Yeah, of him actually enjoying it. Well, yeah, well, I just thought Quan would be, like, the upstanding, like, you know, soldier that would just, like, while well, he's down to earth, so to speak, he's still, like, you know, he's got an image to maintain. No, he was full on for that. Well, I mean, he's sleeping with a prostitute. Remember how you could pay, what's his name, to... No, he's in love with a prostitute. I, I know, there's, there's a difference, but I mean, like, not much of one. I, I feel like, at least for Quan, he at least deserves to get the, you know... Okay, let's get uh, the patriarch. Which way is Denver? Ah, uh, this way. If you would protect that flame, tend to. Oh, we got okay, a so we have to go up, up, and then we right. Shop here if you want to shop here. Ah, uh, sure. We can. We can just see that now. Pit stop. Howdy. Name's O'Leary. We. Hey, wasted refugee. We're loved. You're the oh, nice. The saviors of the refugees. Boy, are we glad to see you. In fact. Was gonna donate this at your HQ when we got the CO. I'll trap launcher. You're here. Holy crap. So, <laughs> there you go. Anyway, we ain't ate in a while. I was hoping we could trade you some things for money to eat. He rummages behind the seat and then hands you a duffel. Uh. uh kiss ass. Your refugees haven't see. been given a fair shake. We're gonna take care of you. Yeah. Well, that's good to hear, Rangers. Oh, nice. Thank you. We'll spread the word in the camps. Uh, okay, sure, let's trade. Oh, thank you. It ain't much. Ooh, he's got med darts. Oh, what are you talking about, ain't much? This guy's stacked a bit. Yeah, he's got a decent amount of stuff. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, dude, he's got, a, he's got energy cells, too. Yeah, Ten apiece. Yeah, if you want to stock up, if you want to buy some, go for it. Okay, yeah, that'd probably be good. Uh... Mostly, I'm gonna. It's mostly for Lucia. I'm gonna sell this crowbar because no one's gonna use it. Fair enough. Uh, army flamethrower. Uh, I'm gonna sell this flamethrower fuel then since you're selling that because nobody's True. gonna. True. Yeah. And nobody's gonna use it without fucking ammo. Uh, if you want, buy some spikes too because Quan's assault rifle uses that. I think. Oh yes, yes it does. Uh, let's see. We're not using drugs, so we can sell this liquid time and jitter. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna sell all our junk. I think we already did. Oh. Okay. Everything else we kind of keep. Oh yeah, tactical new. <laughs> I forgot we spent all our money on that, and we still haven't used it, which is probably good. Okay, um, so it's five bucks per plasma capsule if you want to sell a few of those. Yeah, I might as well. We got we got seven. There we go. Glance plates. We really need someone. I'm starting to think we really need someone with armor modding. I'm really starting to think. Yeah, that might be something to invest in. <clears throat> um, do you plan on using this tank helmet at all? Uh, let me let me see. Let me, tank helmet. Um, let me see. Um, I'm actually. Uh, if you are, that's fine. If not, then maybe we can break it down for scrap. Um, you know what? I will use that. I'm hesitant. The only reason why is because uh, it gives me a uh, it like the scrap helmet. It doesn't give me as much armor, but it gives me plus one to hard ass, and I'm like, uh, kind of like having that. <laughs> lucky, lucky. I mean, <clears throat> you know what? No, no. Keep keep hard ass because I feel like we're gonna get a choice up soon enough yeah. that you're gonna need hard ass for. Um. 
God, mid hypos are 40 apiece, damn. Sorry, Lex probably came back and it freaked Lucky out. Yeah, because, I mean, this scrap helmet gives me plus four to, uh, it gives me plus four to, uh, armor. So it's not that much of an armor loss. I really should probably get rid oh, of Oh, Jesus this. Christ, no glue, or no glow. Yeah. Yeah, you can pretty much only get it. pieces for each. Yeah, it... Yeah, it, uh, it's it's not bad. We have some on stock. I in stock, I believe. Uh, do, you uh, want, do, you, do you want the Chemtech helmet or no? Because you, you're the one who specs um, for weird science <clears throat> and. <clears throat> you know, I I was thinking about it, but the best part about it is the plus eight armor and the healing bonus. Yeah, this is the poison is kind of the benefit. But I'm currently wearing a different armor that also gives me an attack, but it I think it's also friendly fire. Okay. So you know, so yeah, let's keep it. But then as soon as I'm able to equip that, we can sell the other one. I, I love this pickles. Because I think I need. Okay, I'm I'm ready. Right, I'm just doing one last sweep through anything that we may not need. Oh, okay. This is radiation. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Yeah, so far so good. <laughs> okay, good. Says with coughing into it. <coughs> oh, oh, god damn it. Robot nope. steps in front of the car and hit the brakes, but too late. You smash into it and run over it. You stop to check your undercarriage, and the robot gets up and is joined by some friends. Okay, we got Weird Science 2. Get the drive uh, robots by scrambling their circuits. Take advantage of the train to escape. Or. Oh, well, it's either one or three. What do you want to try to do? Uh, do you want to fight him? Oh, we're going to probably fight him anyway. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, well, I mean, not if we escape, but... I mean, do you want combat? Well, no, small chance to escape. Well, but Survival 3, take advantage of the terrain to escape. Oh, right, 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 right. Yes. Uh... kind of want to get some more loot. This is also how we're going to get some scrap, too. Oh, okay. It's weird science, then. Get the drop of the robots by scrambling your circuits. At the top of your lungs, you shout, C, test, kill, F, I, M, kill all humans, dot, X, T. You have just said it wrong because it doesn't stop them, but they do pause for a second, and a second is enough. <laughs> that does make me laugh. Does this unit have a soul? Oh, man, don't bring that. Don't, uh, don't, don't make me feel bad about beating these things to a pulp. You eating chips away over there? What the hell are you doing? No, one of the chocolates. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, oh, yeah. You... Holy shit. These, these are a lot of them. Dark disco bots. Alright, uh. Oh, Jody is pretty hurt. Okay. Um. We got a killer. Right oh, I was there. right. There is a disco bot. Octotron. But my name's Killer. So, yeah. Octotrons and Killers. Yeah. And one disco bot. Okay, where do you, where do you want where do you want me to where do you want me to you mute your mic when you do that? Dude? Ruining the atmosphere here. Okay, what should what do you think I should? I did mute my mic. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, here, let me. I'm gonna move her right here. Okay. Also, most of our team has uh, shock weapons for anti-robots, so this should be actually kind of easy. Oh, nice. I never want to underestimate an opponent. There we go. Oh, hell yeah. I'm actually 
What is the ice cream sound? I, I know, right? Evan, I need you to use, I need you to mutate somehow in this game and learn how to do a Hadoken. <laughs> oh god. I didn't realize we were in fucking Street Fighter. I took damage from that, really? Oh yeah, you ran over some. Holy crap! I have become Death, Destroyer of Worlds. Alright. Alright, your turn. Uh, no, you've become, you've become Paul, party clown of four. Um... Hang on, while you go, while you go, let me open the door. Alright. Ambush. Crash, um... Oh, sorry about that. Dogs are driving me nuts. Prep with her. And then finally, uh... Oh, nice. Not to mention that guy's probably gonna pull up on that. Damn, there. Hey, ambush. Oh, nice. And then I ambush. Oh, damn. That was the Oh. He's got piercing with those drill bits. Get him, Goaty, avenge me! Okay, I'm gonna get- I'm gonna have Quan get you back up. Cause he gets extra movement for that. Yeah, I'm good. Water went down the wrong pipe. Oh, yeah, then. Yeah, we've all done that before. Alright. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be... Oh, uh, that's gonna be weird feeling for the rest of the stream. Yeah, yeah, that, it, isn't it always? Ah, oh, man, she's out of range. Um... Maybe switch Quan to the... Which does build up. Yeah. Just a little surprised is all, you know what I mean? He made it sound like it was a Red Robin commercial. Rip man! Uh, Hypo. Hypo. Yum. Oh, here, pal, let me take care of that bridge. Hey. Appreciate it. Do you mind getting his friends, one of his friends out there, or you want to skip up? Yeah. Yeah, I took Disco out. Disco's dead. Yeah, Hot yeah, heels. yes it is. Refreshed. I also had Quan basically patch you up to full mm -hmm. health, so you, you are, you are good. Oh, yeah, he's also irradiated. I should probably get rid of that. Oh, crap. I'm out. Let's see, will this reach? Um... Uh, let's see, how far can it go? Oof, man. I'm trying to think of I know what I can do. I think I'm an alcoholic. Mm. Holy crap, what did you do? I hacked.
distracted. It's now fighting for us. Oh, awesome. You and your nerds. Gonna move her back to some cover. I prefer the term intellectual badass, thank you. Okay, you and your intellectual badass. Who do you think's the best? I still gotta do Jody. Yeah. Uh, who do you think's the best character we've picked up so far? Honestly, Jody Bell. Really? Yeah. The sniper. Me? Yeah. Who's not waste all that? Stay out. I'm still alive, aren't I? Okay, I'm just... Plus, it's your turn next, and you can just call in the Kodiak. Yeah, I know, but I'd rather not rely on it, you know what I mean? That's... I did not, we did, sorry, we did not fight through Clown Jesus to get a minigun clown head. They can shred use. through enemies and not use it. Risky shot, go for broke, and unreliable like attack, a 70% crit chance, but a 4% hit chance. Fuck it. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm trying not to use too much of the cross boom, but at the same time, it's like, eh. I'm gonna just make the arrow anyway. Yeah, that, that's kind of the attitude I have, you know what I mean? Yeah. Ah, he's out of range. Fuck. And the path is blocked. God damn it. Oh, well, now that nobody's here, I can. Aha! There we go. Uh, which one? You want me to take care of? Which killer do you want me to take care of? The one that's lowest on health, or? Uh, probably the one that has the most health. Okay. Oh, the target's blocked. So it looks like it's this one. Oh, okay. Option number two is. Yeah. Pretty much made the decision a lot easier to make. Oh yeah, I can still move. Leroy Jenkins! No. Oh, really? Oh yeah, I forgot AP is three with this. Oh, it is a robot. Oh, Ooh, damn. lucky, lucky mega or lucky crit. Nice. Another lucky crit. And there we go. Okay, okay. Let's loot these fuckers. Uh, let's see. We got a bunch of bent accutators, damage sensors. Yeah, a lot of, lot of, lot of junk. Found some bolts. Found some spikes. Uh, crystal clear. Hang on, let me go. Injury kit. Hang on, I'll meet you. At, I'll meet you back at the. Uh, I'll meet you back at the Kodiak. I got fucking yelling lucky. Oh, accelerator. Um, let's see. That should be all the loot. Let's see, meanwhile, upgrading characters. Alright, you ready? Uh, ready attribute. To <clears throat> oh, hold on, I'm upgrading characters right now. Oh, wow, Lucia West actually leveled up. Shit. Alright, Evan, we're in luck. We have Toast to Repair at level 10. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, awareness or coordination? Like, I often wonder, those are the two things that I. I like struggle with the most just for the fact that coordination helps coordination helps uh, action points and status resistance while awareness affects ra uh, ranged combat. Eh, I'll say let's just go awareness this time. <clears throat> now Lucia Wesson can also. Uh, 
can uh, keep in mind she can also do weapon modding. So just. Uh, mm. uh, I don't think I'm gonna upgrade any of her stuff now. I'm probably gonna wait and upgrade her small arms. And then her perks: deep pockets, um, shredder shot. Opportunist, you're always looking for an opening and handguns are pretty good at making them. Your strike meter char charges a bonus 5% with each successful handgun attack. Clear cover. Uh, devastation. Barter. Penny pincher. It's all it's all on sale. You buy in bulk to get the best deals on essentials. Buying multiple items instead of just one for us, a 20% discount. Hmm. Devastation. Pack them all together, then unleash the thunder. Shotgun attacks gain plus 25% damage for each enemy hit by the same shot. Hmm. What do you think, Val? Um. As usual, kind of like up to you. I don't know what kind of build you want to go for. Eh. So far, you've just been going like Fisticuffs Almighty with yeah. uh, supporting roles from Quan. Or Quan, and then uh, Lucia being your resident. Handy woman gunslinger? Pretty much. I'm gonna go shredder shot because she does have a shotgun on backup. Alright, come on, let's get out of here. Um, wait for you. Yep. I honestly imagine like me just getting in normal like normally. Or like no no, you getting in normally and then me just sliding across <laughs> sliding across like Bo Duke from the Dukes of Hazard. Well, considering we're in winter times, I imagine you try to do that and then all of a sudden you get stuck on the hood. Well, no, I wouldn't, because, like, you know, I'd be going so fast at that point, that'd create heat. That's and not I, how friction works, and that's not how fast it would create heat. I don't know, I think it still would, because, I mean, they, like, you gotta think that the top of it would be icy. So... Okay, so you're gonna fling yourself off and then towards a yourself. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be the first time. Just saying. Awesome. Take this time to heal everybody. Well, I mean, Crash and... Well, I leveled up Crash and Jody. Or, or, so, it's mostly just I. And then I just need an injury kit, actually. Uh, uh Can't be removed by... No usable item. Hardened skeleton. Can only be removed... Aw, oh, damn it! Damn it. It's right. got a mutation. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm going to eat some uh, Stouffer's Select. Alright, of course. That sucks because fucking... Uh, what is it? Quan uh, got hardened skeleton, so we got a mutation that gives him plus four armor. And I'm like, oh, god damn it. Roadblock. As you enter a wooded ravine, something makes you slow the Kodiak. A movement? A noise? A flash of light? Maybe it was just a feeling, but the night seems darker now. The hairs rise in your neck. Show no fear forward, or trust your in instincts and go cautiously. Uh, you crawl ahead in low gear, eyes darting everywhere, it gets darker and darker. After a, a tight turn, your headlights flash across two big metal structures flanking the road. Structures? No! Robots! Another steps behind the Kodiak. Their servos whine as they lock their guns on you. Nap Black Boys tells you to stop the, stop the vehicle. You don't really have a choice. Oh, great. Please tell me you healed everybody. I, I healed me. Oh. <clears throat> well. So yeah, yeah, the other two leveled up, so they got insta heal. Okay. And looks like this will be Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh, there's Liberty. Alright. Light him up. Wow. And I thought Colorado trash was sad. You made a bad deal, Rangers. My father's using you for cannon fodder. Go back to Arizona before you take a bullet for him. The graves are cold up here. And on your way home, tell him to hire a better class of spy. Uh. Uh. What do you think? Because I don't know. What do you want to do? I honestly don't think we can take her right now, you know what I mean? Did we at all save before this? 
Well, the game saved when we stopped, so that's why I'm kind of like. But before this conversation, though. No. Not unless you want to go all the way back. Yeah, you know what? I'll just. This is a tough call. Yeah. Because we, because well, here's the thing. Because we have the equipment to take them on. Remember, I have shrink grenades for the mechs. Yeah, but I mean, I don't know if the. And then the and then the frozen ferret launcher for her. I mean. You don't have it. No. You know we're not we're not bitches. Points for bravado, but my robots will turn you into a thin red mist before you get a shot off. Want to reconsider? Uh, I, yeah, I kind of, I kind of wanted. Why do you want to overthrow your father? I need some context. Because he's taking too long to die of natural causes. Colorado will die before he does if someone with some vision doesn't take control ASAP. And that's not either of my brothers. <laughs> Think your father's killing Colorado? Are you blind? He's letting a crazy cowboy cult control our oil production. Our main trading hub is run by a bunch of idiots and monster masks. All that should have been state-run ages ago. We... Oh, why am I arguing policy with a bunch of gun jockeys? The point is, my Excuse father has you. Colorado in the palm of his hand, and he's afraid to close his fist. Well, he's not desperate. And not. Yeah, you, you don't think you're probably. I just want to see what's going to happen to the dialogue. Ha! I can see you haven't met him. Vic's a depraved child, and Val's a brain without a spine. I wouldn't trust either one to run a mess tent, let alone a country. To think of all the years my father wasted grooming them for glory when I was right there. God. What else should we know about victory? Shoot him before he talks. Your sanity will thank you, and you'll be doing Colorado a favor. Not that it'll be easy getting to him. He's got his followers hooked on some kind of hypno-happy gas. They'll do anything for him. Including the dog. Hmm. Tell me more about Valor. The sooner he dies, the better for Colorado. He's the perfect puppet for some usurper like the Gippers to put on my father's throne and claim he's the legitimate heir. Of course, killing him would piss Daddy off. And you ass kissers wouldn't want that. Might be the only way to get him out of Denver, though. Those Gippers got their hooks in him deep. Hmm. Hmm. What do you think? Cause I don't think I don't think we're strong enough to take her down. Cause I mean, with vi uh, the missions for the other ones, we're like level nineteen, and we're nowhere near that yet. Yeah. Sure enough. Yeah. All right, you can go. Yeah. Okay, we're done here. You can go. Ha! Thank you for your permission. Squad, roll out. Shoot her while she while her back's turned. My thing is, it just feels like jealousy. <laughs> yeah, probably is. Because I mean, again, like, I don't you know, think he was father really... psychotic, children psychotic. Well, I mean, like, her way of thinking isn't exactly the greatest. Because I honestly, because she's talking about how, like, you know, he has Colorado on the palm of his hand, but he, he's too afraid to close his fist. I said, well, no, he doesn't exactly want to just rule like a despot. <laughs> Walks in the gardens of the gods, didn't you? Oh, thanks for getting rid of those Dorsies. Oh, I love ya. All right, looks like we have an admirer, Val. BB gun. The same Berlin Marshal stops her truck again. <clears throat> Still here, jackasses. Patriarch's Marshals. Go home. Oh, if you sir. Want to report me, get my name right. BB gun. That's G U N N. Yeah. Oh, great. Oh uh, yeah, the Patriarch's Marshals don't like us very much. I kind of want to just kill his kids for the fun of it now. Yeah. Oh. You read me out there, Caballero? You all recovered from that big old Colorado welcome at Dorsey's gave you? Uh... Read you who's this or what kind of a call size red? it's dead red. 
we read you who's this. Ha! Ain't you a redemption one? Switch over to 27.065 megahertz. All will be revealed. Eh, fuck it. Let's switch. Howdy, Rangers. Sorry about the clowning. Have to keep a low profile these days. This is your old pal Angie, otherwise known as Ranger Colonel Angela Death. Hmm. Angela Death? Angela Death? Mm -hmm. Ah, somebody remembers me. What do you know? Figured my name would be stricken from the record after me and my crew pulled our vanishing act. Wasn't our intent when command sent us out here to reconnoiter. But well, things took an unexpected turn. The Ranger Command has been wondering what happened to you. All bad. We came out here for the same reason as you. Command was hoping they could make an alliance with the Patriarch and get some, uh, foreign aid. Trouble was, the more we snooped around, the more we realized that good old Pappy Buchanan was a bloody-handed dictator that the Rangers shouldn't have nothing to do with. <sighs> Unfortunately, Command didn't want to hear it. Yeah, we know that. Told us they were going yeah. to make the deal anyway. Too desperate to be particular. We took a vote, the squad made, and decided that just wasn't the Ranger way. Instead, we made a pact to take Buchanan down and help Colorado become the home of freedom that Arizona could have been if the Rangers hadn't lost the Citadel to the thighs. Why are you telling us to listen? Why do you think? We want you on our side, but not without seeing for yourself that Buchanan's a conniving shitbag. That's why I was calling. There's a man. No, we know he is. Yeah. <clears throat> old bunker in Broadmoor Heights and guarded by Mercs. So you may have to do a little shooting to get to him. But when you do, ask him about his thieves with the Patriarch. It'll open your eyes. Uh, sounds like you're sending us into a trap. I'm not sending you anywhere. I'm just saying, if you want to see the other side of the story, you might look this Cordite fella up. Okay. His name is Ironclad Cordite, Lords of War. a warlord of the Eastern Plains, and one goddamn tough son of a bitch. As to how you find him, I'm a little shaky on the details, but I'm told there's a hidden hatch on some monument at Buchanan Park in Broadmoor Heights. And listen, when you do find him, bust him out of there and do what you can to keep him alive. He could help you with living mm. later. Also, if you need more firepower, he's got a shotgun for a left arm. Hmm. Huh. Eh. <clears throat> we'll check it out when we're done with what we're doing now. Gracias, compadres, and good luck. I'll be in touch. Dead red, over and out. Okay. Alright, pal. What do you want to do? You still want to keep going towards Denver? Because we're almost there. Uh, yeah, might as well keep heading forward. Alright, let's keep this train moving. Hell, I'm just happy we got some fucking radiation shielding for once, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. well, I mean, we just needed to get, we needed it to get through at least one checkpoint. Yeah. To, uh, <coughs> there's more radiation up north. Okay, a song about love, loss, and moving on. A song to touch the heart. Man, they need better taste in music. Alright. The rubble strewn streets of Denver, the Mile High City, the Colorado State Capitol building still stands among the towering mountains. 